Yeah, that's right. The move by state regulators essentially allows doctors to transfer their power over to pharmacists so that they can write prescriptions for birth control and studies show that about a third of women who try to access prescription birth control have barriers that they encounter when they try to get it. I appreciate it. I mean, I'm a woman living in this state, so I expected us to be cared for and represented. So thanks. Happy about it. Kaya Wiggins is among many women taking in the latest announcement from Michigan state officials increasing access to hormonal birth control by now allowing pharmacists to prescribe the medications. Especially with everything going on, reproductive rights are a necessity. State regulators released a new take on Michigan's public health code, which makes way for the change, and it comes as a surprise to many. It is kind of shocking because, like I said, like I thought birth control was already something that pharmacists could prescribe. Governor Gretchen Whitmer explained it in a tweet saying Michigan pharmacists can now partner with doctors to directly prescribe self-administered hormonal birth control like oral contraceptives, the patch and the ring. Expanding access to birth control for women across Michigan means they can plan their own future on their own terms. Pharmacists being able to do that is like a really great idea because they also know a lot about the chemicals that go into birth control, all the side effects, so they can inform you just like a doctor can. An hour ago I just got the notice. Rudy Najem of iPharmacy in Livonia is still digesting the policy, but says it's welcome news, especially after birth control supplies were depleted a few months ago when Roe v. Wade was overturned. We had a rush of people coming to get Plan B and we sold out in like a day or two. The basic, if one gets more open and more pharmacies are dispensing it, it's going to be more affordable for everybody's reach, so I don't see any reason to stock up on it. Now, pharmacists will be able to opt into the program, but the exact details in terms of how it will work, that's still unknown. State officials are expected to release more guidance on that front. Michigan will be among 20 states that allow pharmacists to write prescriptions for birth control. Reporting live, Dave Kinchin, Fox 2 News. Yeah, Dave, interesting point that you bring up there because the department, Lara, that's in charge of all of this really says uh, in their writings that it's not gonna require pharmacists to prescribe these contraceptions if they're unwilling they may say, hey, I don't want to. So it's really up to the pharmacist, isn't it? Yeah, that's right. The pharmacist we spoke to tonight says he's willing to do it. Others may not be willing to. So you're right. It's absolutely a choice. And the state regulation definitely makes that clear for sure. Yeah, and the biggest choice that's coming up is November 8th, when, of course, this will be a ballot initiative about abortion. That so many people go out and vote on both sides. Many people fired up about it. Dave Kinchin for us live. Thank yep. you.